Hey everyone, what's happening? It's Laura Messiah here, we're live. Uh, I got a request on my YouTube channel just the other day because I was talking about my Style Solution Style Planner. Um, it's a book, it's like, it's like a workbook. It's a workbook that I created a while ago, but I you know, just happened to mention it on a YouTube video and people have been like totally into it and loving it and then some people were like can i see more of it before i make the decision to purchase it they kind of wanted a little tour of the book so i was like that would be fun so we're gonna do a little style planner tour and i'm gonna walk you through this awesome tool that i created and that I use. Uh, I've said this many times, but it doesn't hurt to say it again. Anything that I create, whether it's a book, a course, whatever, video series, it's stuff. It's I created it because I needed it and I use it and other people then use it and it works for them because it worked for me. I'm like my own test dummy. So this book, it's called The Style Solution, 30 Days to Your Signature Style. It's a style planner. This guides you through the process that I use to improve my own personal style. It is the same um, methods that I use to work with my clients, whether they're virtual or in person. So I put it all in this like handy dandy little book so you can walk through the process yourself. Uh, a lot of my clients opt to take Personal Style University which is like the super next level of the information that's presented in this book. That's where there's, you know, videos, there's community. It's like the super deep version, but that program's closed right now and it costs a hell of a lot more than this book. So if you wanted to kind of like get your feet wet, start on the process, you're a self-starter who can do things on your own, then this joint is perfect. So the first thing that I wanted to make really clear is that this is a digital book. This is an ebook that I encourage you to actually print out and like put in a binder and use. Right now, I don't have the structure in my business to actually like have these things printed and mail them to people. Um, I'm hoping to get there. Like, the more interest you guys have in the digital version and the more support you give to me and my business, then the more resources that I'll have access to, to work on actually like selling a hard copy. Uh, I've been making some prototypes of hard copies, um, but right now it is strictly digital. So when you order it, you're gonna get the color version and you're also going to get the black and white version. So it's up to you whether you want to like spring for print and color or if you want to keep it cheap and print it black and white. Either way, it works. So here we are. I, okay, I love like school supplies and things. So I've got many different binders. <laughs> this cute one at Target. This one's also from Target. I think it's just fun to like put all of the papers into something that makes you feel excited and something that you can keep in your closet, uh, you know, and it's not like an eyesore. So these are the ones that I got. And then again, I was like messing around and I made a custom binder that actually says the style solution, but I accidentally ordered one that's like way too big. <laughs> so that didn't work out as planned, but it doesn't mean that I can't show you what's going on um, in it right here. So I printed out all the pages. I got dividers because this is broken out into five really clear steps. And then there's like some bonus um, material happening. So let me just show you what's doing. Okay. I love this thing. Okay, first you get your little um, table of contents, which kind of walks you through the different steps. So there's an introduction, how to use the planner. Um, step one is, that's the first little section, is clearing out your past. So in this section, you're going to get my seven day selfie challenge, 
Um, if you're in PSU or if you've purchased one of my books in the past, then you know that this is like the first step towards your transformation. So everything you need to complete the selfie challenge is here. Um, there's also a selfie challenge follow-up questionnaire. So, you know, for me, I'm all about taking action and getting into the position where you can actually have results. So instead of just taking like cute photos of yourself every day, you're getting these follow-up questions that can really help you dive deeper into your current state of style and where you actually want to take it. Um, next, we go through style roadblocks, a style goals worksheet, and the ultimate wardrobe checklist, deluxe edition. So many of you have opted into my freebie where um, I give you an ultimate wardrobe checklist, but in this one, it is the deluxe version. Let me, let me open it up here. So the deluxe version, spans over two pages. So as you can see, mine's filled out because I actually use the stuff. So it goes through basics um, and it goes through also statement pieces. So anything that you're missing on this list, you can add to your shopping list, which is in another section of this book. So that's pretty dope. Um, and you can just see like in my, this is an older, this is an older planner. Um, also, like in my prototyping, I've printed out some other ones, so I'll show you something more recent. But this is the selfie challenge. So it's when I had long hair. Oh, look, I almost wore that blazer today. So it goes through what I wore, how I felt, and how I was perceived. So you can go through and just kind of keep track of the beginning of your transformation. Here, this is another version of the planner. And the good thing, the good thing about having it as a digital download instead of like a hard copy book, so I know people get caught up on like, I want the hard copy. When you get the digital version, you can reprint it out when you're ready to go through your style transformation again. So this is something that I did later and I got a little artsy with it. Um, you know, I did some, some little doodling there and just kept all of my seven day selfies um, right here. And it gives you instructions on how to go through it. It's pretty dope. And then after, I'm just gonna hold up this version because it's a lot easier than holding up the binder. Um, but there's the questionnaire follow-up after. So it's like just questions of, you know, on a scale from one to 10, how happy were you with your outfits? Um, describe your current style in three words. Do those words represent you? Because this is where some of the eye-opening things start to occur is like, wow, looking back at my style, you know, I'm seeing, for me, I had risk taker bold and tomboy chic. Um, those words actually do happen to describe me. Um, maybe not, I'm not a risk taker in life, but in style, yes. But if you were to say no, like, wow, I'm wearing these things that are showing that I'm comfortable, you know, sloppy, whatever, and you check no, it's like, great, now we're like headed towards change. So there's more follow-up questions um, as they go. And... Actually, this one I did like much cuter because I put stickers. I love stickers. That's why I feel <coughs> like it's really fun to print stuff out too. So then there's um, the style roadblocks worksheet. So you can go through that and figure out like what is holding you back in your style. Sorry, I'm like coughing, I'm thirsty. Okay, now, Step two is all about finding inspiration, creating your mood board, identifying your color palette, and then you get this awesome style profile worksheet. <coughs> Guys, why am I coughing so much? So in here, like the way that I did it, and again, this was like from a year ago, so my style has changed since, but I just cut out some things from magazines. Um, I put them throughout the pages in the book just to like keep me inspired um, 
build out my style profile. Oh look, I can do it like this. Added more mood images here. Ooh, I actually ended up buying that. Cool. What else have I done since I developed my style last year? So all of that is right there. What else, what else? So step three, this is the shopping section. So this is has a closet assessment. Oh geez, I'm getting like some sort of alert, some news alert. Looks like someone got shot or something. I don't know, news. Not to downplay someone getting shot, but you know, those things just come and surprise you when you get those news alerts. Okay, I'm gonna hold up this. Why don't I just hold up what I already have open? Yeah. <laughs> so you get your closet assessment like pie chart here where you can figure out what percentages um, of your closet are taken care of and not. This one's unfilled out, but I think my other one is. Uh, shopping list, this is great. So here, you know, you can put list of things that you want and then their priority. So is it low, medium, or high? Because I find that when we're shopping, we just start buying stuff and we're not actually waiting like, waiting like a scale. Like, do I need this? Will this help move my style forward or no? So that you can kind of really assess it. Um, another thing that's really helpful in this book is stores by budget. So if you're on a low budget, somewhere in between high budget, it gives you some resources that you can test out um, as far as shopping. I also go through brands by budget. Um, and then this is fun. This is like, this is the keep and return questionnaire. So once you've done your shopping, like deciding, do I need to keep this? Or do I need to let this shit go? So like here, these are really good questions to ask yourself, by the way. I should ask myself these things more often. Um, do I have something like this in my closet already? I'm definitely, I do that a lot. <laughs> I'm like, ooh, I love jean jackets, I'll get 50. Um, can I create at least three looks with this piece? Can I afford it? Can I resell it or consign it later? Why am I buying this? Um, what is my emotional state right now? Do I think buying this will give me a quick fix emotionally? So that is something, you know, I'll shop because I'm bored, because I'm happy, because I'm sad. I like shopping. Uh, but asking yourself those questions can really help you make better decisions while you're shopping. Um, so step four is putting it all together. So in here, I give you different outfit formulas that you can try out. Um, so many people get stumped when they're coming up with outfits, figuring out their style. They don't know what things go together. So I have 20 outfits here that you can test out. And then I have a template where you can create your own formulas. So you can come up with like really interesting combinations that work for your style, work for your body and actually write them down so you can remember to go back to them. Now, this is probably my favorite part of the book. It's the custom lookbook template. And it's really simple, you know, like a lot of this stuff isn't rocket science, but the fact that it's laid out for you to do it helps make you do it. And the doing it is what makes the freaking thing useful. If you're like, oh, I can just, you know, make my own lookbook, well, go for it, but you probably won't do it. Um, why don't you take the one that's already here? So for this, um, if you want stress-free mornings, the best course of action is to plan ahead, block off a few hours, blast some tunes, and get to styling. Create as many looks as you can with the goal being 30 looks. So now you're not gonna have to ask yourself, what am I gonna wear today? Now here's the magical part. Let me unplug this. So I have the link to this in the book, okay? And when you place your order um, in the receipt is the link to buy this, if you so choose. This is the HP Sprocket. It's a little printer that you just um, hook up the app on your phone 
And any photos on your phone, on your Instagram, uh, you can print on this little printer and it prints it out as a sticker. So, oops, sorry, Instagram is tripping. So this is what I have on today, okay, twins. And I'm satisfied with this outfit, so I would like to permanently catalog this into my lookbook. So this is a little sticker, which we can just peel right here. And then in mine, see, like anytime I have an outfit that I really like, um, I go ahead and put it inside. And you can write, you know, what the pieces are or where is like a good place for you to wear it um, in the little note section if you so choose. Man, look at me, I got a lot of outfits. Oh, here's a blank space. So we just stick this here, look 24. And now I have a future outfit to wear. So I printed out a few more. I wore this yesterday. Little shorts, little rock and roll. T. Nails would be really useful right now. I like to keep short nails. I'm not a long nail girl. Hey, Edge. Oh my gosh. Of course, because I'm live, I can't peel a freaking sticker. Here we go. Stick it right here. There's another look, my little sweater. Enjoy that, would wear it again. And see, like, you know, you might be thinking, oh, sweater and jeans, like, Lauren, how could you forget that shit? Well, the fact that I put it with these little slides, I might not remember that I really liked um, that combination. I would just end up putting it with like some whatever shoes. So I'm gonna stick that right there. So see, I already have 26 looks in my lookbook. And because this is a digital download, once I run out of pages, I can just print it out again and I'm all good. So I wish I had the book with me, I don't. Uh, but there's this book, it's called Hand Lettering for Stress Relief. And I was like, I wanna be relieved of stress. So I started like messing around, which is why I'd be like decorating this stuff all cute. So if you want to, you know, like me, you can like get your markers out and just kind of G it up and make it special. These are the best markers ever. I got these at the container store and they're like nice and thin and they don't bleed through. These right here, they're awesome. And then I bought all these stickers. I'm a nerd, guys, like for real. Let's see, I got these cute stickers, these stickers. So then it becomes fun. It's not just like, ooh, I have to like do this chore of making these outfits that I wanna wear. It's like a fun, kind of like you can get into your inner child time, right? Printing shit out, drawing, stickering. I like it, I don't know, maybe you'll like it too. Okay, and then, was that step five? Yeah, step four, putting it all together. And then step five is maintenance. So for this, I give you a closet maintenance guide. I give you all of my essential tools that I think you should have in your closet. If you watched my closet sanctuary video yesterday, yesterday, um, you know that I talked about like all the cool shit that you need in your closet. Um, I have a list of it here, plus some other items that I didn't get to touch on. My favorite laundry things. Um, I even have a list here on how to merchandise your closet, which is something that I talked about in the video uh, for the closet sanctuary of like how to make everything, you know, short to long, color coordinated, the whole sitch. So that is, uh, that guide is in here. Um, I even have a tailoring cost sheet. Everybody who's like, nothing ever fits me. Get that shit tailored. What are you talking about? Dude, clothes aren't, no two people are exactly the same, okay? We can like both be a size four, but like my butt will be bigger than your butt. Your legs will be shorter than my legs. Like nobody is the same size. So you're just gonna have to get on board with the fact that if you want the perfect fit, you're gonna have to go to the tailor. 
People are always afraid that the tailor is going to be so expensive. Well, I already, let's just open this. I already uh, costed it out for you. So this should be like pretty much the going rate of what things cost. So it's just like a handy little resource for you to have. Um, I even have a fabric care guide here, just really short, um, you know, not a fabric magician. Y'all can read the tag inside your clothes, but just how to, you know, care for di different materials. So once you cultivate your style um, and make it awesome, you can keep up with it, both like style wise and just maintenance wise. And then I put a bonus in here. Um, it's a garment glossary and a fabric glossary. So if you're just curious of like what certain necklines are, what things are called, um, what different types of fabrics and patterns are, all of that is defined um, in this little bonus glossary. So that's kind of the walkthrough. Um, I find it just incredibly useful and helpful. I think probably, you know, outside of just the fun of being creative and posting your photos, it's really the questions that are in this book that take you to that next level. Like going through the style roadblocks, um, setting your style goals. You know, for example, um, what is your main motivation for changing and updating your style? It's not like, trust me, it's not just to look cute. You guys might think that, I hate my clothes, I wanna look cute. You know, there's some other motivation. And I think depending on what time you are in in your life and what your focus is at the moment will motivate you changing or updating your style. It could be that you got a promotion or you want a promotion, you're heading to the next level in your career, then we need to focus our wardrobe in that area. It could be that you're ready to get back out into the dating scene and now you need clothes that are gonna be great for going out or for like attracting a mate. So understanding your motivation, like just getting really clear about that piece alone can help your style grow in so many different ways. Um, one of my favorite questions here, um, I ask this to all my clients, is like, what does success look like to you at the end of this process? Um, I was watching an Instagram story of one of my clients. She's like a really awesome badass. She teaches people sales and just how to dominate. Her name's Rachel Luna, if you want to look her up. Um, but she, has like this event coming up and she said i promise you i'm probably butchering this but she's like i promise you you will get what you came for just depends on what you come for right so defining why you're doing this you know like why do i want to change my style is it because i just want to have fun i want to go through this little book and i want to have a good time i want to have some me time i want to go through this book and i want to have like a real true change at the end if you can get clear on your success and why you came, you're gonna, you're gonna get that shit. You know, it's like when you walk into something and you're like, this is gonna be stupid. Well, it's gonna be stupid. You already mapped out that's what you wanna get out of this. You wanna be right that this shit was stupid. Um, so set up your success you know, roadmap right here in the beginning. That's why it's in step one. Um, Instagram just paused out, hopefully it comes back. Uh, set it up in the beginning and you'll be gold. So there are, how many questions here? 18, yeah, there's like about, there's like 20, you know, really awesome questions just for the goal setting alone. Come on, Insta. It's probably on like stupid, no, it's not. I don't know, hopefully it comes back. Hold on. Sorry, Facebook. Oh my gosh. 10 live video. Getting my arm all up in this. I like to make sure that like all the social channels can like, you know, get to see the magic. But Instagram be tripping all the time. Uh, so yeah, there's, there's closet cleanse worksheet. I mean, it's just going to the next level of style that you probably having gone on before. So that is the Style Solution book. You can 
click on the link if you're on Facebook. Um, I put it in the post. If you're, well, Instagram's gone, but if you're on my Instagram page, the link is in my profile, or you can go to my website, lormasai.com, um, right in the nav, it says books and courses, click there and you'll find it. It will be delivered to you immediately and it's up to you to get that puppy printed in whatever uh, form that you want to. And I would love to see your progress as you go through it. So, you know, DM me on Instagram, send me an email, send me a message. Um, I love seeing your style transformations because this shit works, okay? Clearly put, it just does. And I like to um, see, see that all my hard work was not a complete waste. And don't forget the link to this printer is also uh, comes in your receipt, so you can check that out too. Thanks all for watching, and I'll catch you guys later. Have a safe and wonderful holiday weekend.